You are going to regret that, and I'm speaking from experience. Look, the last thing that I need right now is the diet police on my case. It's not worth it. It's not about him. Why do boys always treat me like dirt? Look, it's nothing you've done. Apart from picking me in the first place, maybe. So it is my fault. You see, they only go out with losers. I said, maybe. Maybe you need to look at your selection criteria rather than eating your own body weight in chocolate. I was hoping to catch you, sweetheart. What do you want? Well, don't be like that. How do you expect me to be after yesterday? I know. I got a bit carried away, but I've been under a lot of strain, you know that. I just wanted you to know that if I upset you... If? How could you possibly have any doubts? And it's not just me. Nobody wants you here. Why can't you just get the message? Fair love, wait. Oi, just leave her alone, will you? You've done enough damage already. What's it to you? I'd appreciate you keeping your nose out of my family's business. If you care about your family, you'd have backed off by now. All you're doing is making them hate you even more. You don't know what you're talking about. Well... I know what Faye thinks of you, and I know what he did yesterday. Look, if that is your idea of a charm offensive, you've got the charm, then. I was at the end of my tether. After that, Debbie woman came round and wound us up. I, I wasn't thinking straight. From what Faye said, she was only trying to make you see reason. Well, I hope she never joins the diplomatic corps. She was goading me, provoking me. It was her fault the red mist came down, not mine. 